sorry chat we're back my bad my bad chat sometimes nature calls ethica no ethic that's an ethica London fog. We haven't gone through these uh, jackets yet. Appreciate everybody hopping back in. Sorry about that. Had to dip out for a second. I normally try not to on live, but had to get her done. Did you get the shoes? No, they didn't drop yet. They drop in seven minutes. Um, so I haven't gone for the shoes yet. But we didn't get the shoes last night, if that's what you're asking. No, I didn't get the shoes last night. North Face jacket, 25 bucks is a pass, unfortunately. It's a good North Face, too. I'll have to remember that that's here for next week. Somebody's probably already been through this section, to be 100% honest with you. Almost certain somebody has. We're going to go through the shorts here in just a minute. Should everybody hopping back in. Here's a North Face. 10 bucks. Why are you so cheap? Maybe somebody hasn't gone through the jackets. The high vent North Face for 10 bucks just chilling here. Uh, yes, please. Yes, please. There's a little bit of pilling up here. I think that'll come off. I'm going to look this over and make sure this all. I think that comes right off. All the way down. Hello, beans. <laughs> oh my gosh. Dude, this is crazy. This is a good jacket. Ministry of Supply for $12.50. Oh my gosh. That's insanity. That is crazy. That is crazy. Nobody's been through these jackets. There's no way somebody's been through these jackets. There's no way. That's just chilling here. Go look up that jacket, everybody. If you want to know a good brand, go look up that jacket. That's just chilling here. What? Appreciate all those follows coming in. If you're new here, definitely hit that follow button. Top I'm left hand corner. Made in USA, Woolrich. Is this a down Woolrich? It is a size extra small, so that's why I'm making sure I check and see what it's made out of. Hmm. Why does it not say what it's made out of? I'm pretty sure this is down. It's only 10 bucks. It is made in the USA, Woolrich, so we'll probably scoop that. It looks to be down. Will you show us what you did find at the end? Yeah, tonight at 8.30. We do a live at 8.30, and we'll show you everything that we picked up. Tonight at 8.30. Uh, me and my wife will show you. She's also thrifting the women's section right now, so you'll see a little bit of men's and a little bit of women's. Today so far has been a really, really good day of thrifting. I thought for sure that it would have been bad, but shopping day, it is a shopping day. You already know. Like, no, appreciate all those follows coming in. Yeah, hit that follow button so you get a notification as soon as we go live. Like I said, tonight we'll be going live showing off all of our finds. Alright, I know there was some there was some piranha pants over here last week too, or piranha shorts. So let's try to let's try to find them. Let's try to find those piranha shorts. Almost 10 for the Travis drop. Yep, as soon as it turns 10. It's a it's a draw, so you don't have to be there right away. Um, but yeah, 10 o'clock, you'll see me swipe out of the live really quick, and then I'll be right back, I promise. But I got to go for the Travis Scott. If you guys have the sneakers app, you should be going for the Travis Scott shoes today. Go for bigger sizes. Bigger sizes will sell better if you want to buy them for resale. Or if you want to buy your boy a pair, um, go for a size 12 women's. So I will rock those Travis Scott's sneakers app. S-N-K-R-S. Um, 
play over 600 people and only put a few, a few so few likes i don't know because i just restarted that's probably why i had a bunch of likes before this you guys can read like it if you want just tap that screen here's some piranha shorts size 33 these will be 650 i'll scoop those up Let's get K way to 20k likes. Let's go. Two minutes. Two minutes. I'll be hopping off the live for just a quick second, and then I'll be right back. So I gotta go for those shoes. Hopefully we can get through this aisle before I have to do that, though. We probably can. Tap tap tap. Hit that follow. Tap tap tap. If you're re-watching this on YouTube, make sure you hit that uh, subscribe button as well. Short section lately has been a bunch of junk. I haven't seen any like really like amazing shorts. Izod. I'm willing to. Let's go. Theory shorts. All right, chat. It's going to pause for a second. I'll be right back. I'm going to go for the shoes and then I'll hop back in. So don't leave. I'll be back. Tomorrow. Actually, that was the cleanest Travis Scott drop on the sneakers app I've ever seen in my life. Uh, normally, it lags super bad. You can't ever get in. But that time, it was actually pretty smooth. So, shout out sneakers for fixing their app, making it easy. But yeah, if you guys want a uh, free, free uh, almost $1,000, um, you should go uh, enter in the uh, Travis Scott drop right now on sneakers app. If you win a pair, I'm sure resale value will go down, but it will at least be 700 bucks if you get a decent size and resale value. I'm trying to get a size for myself though. Your boy wants a Roxy Travis. I don't grab Vineyard Vine shorts, no. Vineyard Vine shorts don't sell really well. Unless they're like super cheap, I'll pick them up, but here they're like seven bucks. So I don't pick them up. Christian Dior, $44.99. Holy cow, what is this made out of? Acrylic, yeah, no. Appreciate everybody hanging out. Sorry, I had to leave multiple times today. I normally try not to, but there's a Peter Millar. They want 15 for it. We're gonna leave that. What size are you? Probably a 2XL, considering all the rest of them that I found today were all size 2XL. Yep, it's a 2XL. Hopefully that'll be here next week. A little too pricey for your boy this week. If you're new here hit that follow button i do these lives every week go over what i find um if you missed it this live will be up on youtube later today um, and we'll also go over our finds here and on youtube later tonight as well live in action here's another peter millar too much too much well at least we know it's here for next week the ch champion thought that might have been a champion todd snyder Blair, Infinity, nothing, 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 nothing. Oh. Catton. Man, not, not a lot over here. There's already been a couple of thrifters that hit this section, so I'm not like surprised if I don't find too much. But I should at least find something. Todd Snyders are good. Yes, they are. Champion Todd Snyders are like really good. But that was just a regular champion. I always look for the, the collabs whenever I'm over here. Thomas Parker, New York. Is that what it says? Thomas Parker? Yeah, Thomas Parker. She looks like a nice item. And it is, it's only cotton though. It feels like it's wool almost. And how much money do you spend each day, if you don't mind me telling? Um, I don't mind. Um, it depends on the day. Like last week, we spent in this store, we spent a thousand bucks. All items that we bought from this thrift. 
Um, if you want to watch that video, that's a pretty crazy one. That's up on YouTube right now. This week, I don't know if we're going to spend a thousand, but we are going to spend a ton because I already have a full cart. And I still have like three aisles to go through. And then I have the women's stuff too. After I'm done with this section, I do wander off to the women's cardigans because I do know that area decently well. It's like the only women's section that and women's jeans I do know pretty well. When do you find out if you got the shoes? The shoes, you'll find out um, the draw ends. I think it's like a 15 minute draw. It might be a 30 minute draw because this is a, this is a pretty big drop, but it's a 15 minute draw. You find out like directly after the draw ends. It takes them like a um, couple minutes to uh, weed out all the bots that entered. And then you should be, you should know, and you'll get a notification on your phone if you did win. Um, make sure you also enter for all the sizes. If you scroll down, there's kids sizes too. And the kids' sizes have good resale value. So if you're not buying for your kids, um, then you can buy those. There's another Peter Millar. I'll have to remember those are over here next, next week. But yeah, the kids' sizes have good resale. So if you want to just buy them to make a quick 100 bucks, you can buy them and flip them pretty quick. Where do you go for the shoes? Sneakers app, S-N-K-R-S. -S. If you don't already have the app, good luck getting in. This is a Robert Graham polo, but they want too much for it. Um, good luck getting in and putting all your information in right now, because I'm pretty sure the uh, the whole app is probably lagging with as many people that are trying to get in there and get the get the shoes. But you can try for it. SNKRS app. It's the Nike app. And go for bigger sizes. And be quick, because I think you only have like four minutes to enter. Uh, did the clothes of the stores come with people's donations or some store? So this store actually purchases their items for resale. So they buy them wholesale and then they put them up. So, yeah, we learned about that in Miami. It's a nice J. Crew jacket. It's five bucks. I wonder if I should pick this up and just list it next season. I probably am for five bucks. I mean, that's a really nice J. Crew Sherpa line jacket. They got this uh, this Lucky brand right behind it. I'm gonna pass on the Lucky brand though. I'll let somebody else have it. It's a decent Orvis, but I'll pass on that Orvis. A shacket, exactly. That's what Chris at Peak would say, it's a shacket. Orvis. This one's a nice one. It's even got the patches on the sleeves, but they want so much for it. I might pick that up next week. Uh, what do they buy from? I have, I think, so from what I understand is, you, you know, um, up north they have the service that comes to your door and picks up donations for veterans. Um, so what they do is they buy from that association, and then they also donate a small um, portion of their profits to the Veterans Association as well. So I think Based off what the online says about this store, that's where they get it from. It's a nice American Eagle sweater. Not enough profit in that bad boy though. Um, Travis shoes are open now for draw now. Yeah, I already, I already went, I already entered in them, entered for them. Hopefully, hopefully we hit, hopefully we hit. Cross our fingers, this'll be the first pair of Lowe's I win. I really want a pair of Travis Lowe's just for the toe. I'm buying these from myself, not for resale. Could you imagine wearing like a pair of $700 shoes on your feet? Uh, that'd be that'd be awesome. No, I'm just kidding. I probably would keep them in my closet for like a year and decide if I ever want to take them and put them on my feet. $700 shoes on your feet is pretty crazy. Um, I already wear pretty expensive shoes, but that's that's kind of, that's rich people stuff right there. The boy ain't that rich. Appreciate all the follows coming in. Yeah, this this sweater section looks like it was it was already um, pretty much hit. Ten dollar North Face um, sweater. We'll we'll leave that one behind for next week as well. You can't beat it every section right at the beginning. 
that's kind of what it's looking like. I missed out on the sweaters today, but that's okay. Do not pick up Columbia? No, Columbia does not have good resale value. Great brand for wearing, but it's not great resale value. Columbia fell off like years ago. I remember when I first started reselling, it was on the way out. Four years ago, it was on the way out. Here we go. Little men's, this is a men's small, but it is a North Face jacket. We'll pick that up for 10 bucks, that's not bad. A smaller size i wish it was bigger but we'll scoop that up we might run that on whatnot actually so random whatnot throw in uh, by the way if you're not following us on whatnot you probably should be um if you haven't signed up i have a link in my bio you can sign up through that link and you get 15 dollars to spend for free so head on over to whatnot and sign up free 15 bucks you might as well do it just for the 15 dollars because you get it for free there's another peter millar they have tons of peter millar here but they want 15 for them why why Ooh. A little marmot. Marmot, full zip. It's got a little gunk on the front, but I think that'll come off. Hooded marmot for 15. That's a scoop. Like a $40 jacket. Easy all day. Small would fit young teens. Yeah. I'll still pick it up at 10 bucks. It's it's a you know North Face sells. If you find a North Face jacket for you know 10 or under, you should probably scoop it up no matter what size it is, because it will still sell. Uh, what size is the marmot? The marmot is a size, um, it's a size medium, size medium marmot full zip jacket. It's a Lacoste sweater, 750 for black, it's got gunk on it. That had no gunk on it, I might consider. But with the gunk on it, we're gonna leave it. Yeah, that's not bad. This is actually decent. This is an LL Bean, but it's got the hit on the front, which is always great. Makes it sell a little bit better. Damn, they want this is spirit jersey. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? They want 25 for this, but I know spirit jerseys can be really good. Found three pairs of Lululemon shorts on the rack together. Nice. What do you guys think? Spirit jersey? Disney World? What do you think that goes for? What size is it? Dusty. It is a size. It's a size medium. They want 25 for it. Um, which is kind of crazy, but it is a spirit jersey, and I know the spirit jerseys can do good. 60 bucks? Okay. If it's 60, I'll scoop it. The Carbon to Cobalt, it's a good brand. Scoop that up. 40? 40? 40's not so good. 60's okay. If it's 60, we'll pick it up. I guess I'll have to look it up. And up, depending. Okay, 60 and up. I like, I like that. I've never found a spirit jersey before, so... Nice. Nice. A little spirit jersey. Depends on the hit. Okay, I'll show you the hit really quick. <clears throat> That's the back. It's got the Walt Disney World back hit. And then the front just looks like this. Long sleeve with the little hit on the front. I don't know those. I don't know those very well. I've never actually found one before. I already go through this. I think I already did, right? Yeah, I already went through that. Price too high? Yeah, it is It is pretty highly priced, but I can always leave it here and pick it up next week. If it's too high a price, I'll pick it up next week for $12.50. Guess I'll do the, I'll do some research at the end. Uh, Make sure it's worth picking up. I'd wait till it's half, okay. We're gonna leave it right here. Remember, it's between all the purples. Somebody next week yell, Spirit Jersey! Yeah, I thought that might have been too highly priced. Custom Spirit Jersey, I never thought I'd say that. I know. So they know, they know what they have here. 
that's okay. I'll, I'll pass. I'll pass. I feel, I feel better about passing because I didn't really want to spend 25 on that shirt anyway. Rail. Rail used to sell it. I haven't moved rail in a while. Alright, let's see what we got. We still have half of the... No, we already went through the other half of pants. We still got the um, men's men's uh, suits to go through. And I think one other section. Oh, the vests, too. We got to go through the vests that are on the corner. The little corner rack. I think those are with the suits, so we can scoot over there really quick and look at those. Somebody already went through the suits earlier, but we'll look through them one more time. Maybe they missed out on some stuff. What was that? It said, it said public rec. I was like, damn, public rec. Nope. I never miss suits now. Yeah, suits are money. I sold a suit this morning, actually, for 50 doll hairs. It was a Zegna. Zegna shoot? No, it wasn't a Zegna. It was a Armani Calazoni or Calazon, or however the hell you pronounce that word. Um, it sold for 50 bucks. I paid 15 for it last week, and it sold for 50 plus ship. So after fees, shipping, cost of goods, that should be about 30 bucks profit. I'll buy Burberry. It suits my local thrift, 999 each. Let's go. That's awesome. Yeah, I'm, I'm enjoying seeing all the suit finds. People have been, uh, people been messaging me yeah. with their, their suit finds. See, he's down there right now. He's going through the suits. So we might not find any. We'll go through like half of them. If we don't find any, we'll switch over to the women's section. Because it looks like he's already uh, scooping them. Which is fine. I still got a bunch of suits to list. So to be honest, I don't really want any more suits. We'll go through them really quick. We'll see what we got. What do you guys think? It's a size 6. It is 25 bucks, but it is a side zip. Let me clean you guys off. It is a side zip. What do you think this will go for? I think this is like an $80 jacket. Pass, do you budget your days? Do you budget out your days? No. I just buy as much as I can. It's 25, but it is the side zip one throw it under the arm just in case. Cool, I'll always sell, yeah. What uh, suits do you recommend? I, I can't recommend any because I'm just learning about suits. So I would be the last person to actually ask for recommendations for. How do you not have a, more than 10K likes? I, I had to use the bathroom, so I had to end my life. So. Polo Sport Ralph Lauren women's barn jacket. Size small, 12 bucks. The Mojo jacket was 170. What's resell on that though? What do you guys think? Thir uh, 13 bucks. It's a Polo Sport barn jacket. It's got the corduroy collar. I think this is like 60 bucks minimum. Yes, on the Polo. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's a that's a scoop. I think it's like 60 minimum. Probably plus ship too. It's on pole. I grab. Yeah, we'll pick that up. What about the Lulu for 25? It's a side zip Lulu. It's 25 bucks. Obviously, it's a little bit more than I like to spend, but it's a Lululemon. Who will go with 40 to 50? Okay, we'll pass on the Lulu then. I'm not gonna not gonna spend 25 for it to go for 50. That's that's not enough. So goodbye, Lululemon, for 25 bucks. Hurts my soul. That Woolrich is still here for 80. How do you package suits? I normally just um, wrap them up and throw them in a box. Um, normally they fit in the shoe boxes very well, or 
they're small enough, I'll put them into a padded flat rate envelope. Guess, yeah, I'm not think we're, I don't think we're gonna find any suits today. I think um, the gentleman at the end, uh, I think he got all the suits. I'm pretty sure he got all the suits. This might be a waste of time. We'll come back at the end. I don't, I don't want to waste time and go go through a section that's already been hit. We do need to go through the polos, though. I haven't gone through the polos yet. That was also hit, but there's a good chance like people missed the, the niche polos. Polos you're not really, people don't really know about. Columbia, I think this is a new rack. Vineyard Vines shorts, but they want too much for those. Nike for 10, I'll pass it to Nike. Do they keep bringing stuff out? Yeah, all day. You can literally come to the store. Like I can come now and then like later on today, Come back to the store and still find more stuff. That's how much stuff they're constantly stocking. What about polo polos? I wonder what Surf's Up thinks about polo polos. This one's only five bucks. Somebody was calling me. It's a Foot Joy Athletic Fit. It is brand new. The way you can tell it's brand new is because it has this thing here, but it's got this huge logo on the front, so it's a pass. That logo is going to make it super hard to sell. what he's doing with that card stack like that he got all the suits yeah he knows what he's doing that's why I'm, I'm just like he can have the suits today the suit section is good but um i have so many to list right now that i'm like you know i don't really need to get any more i'll let him have them i'll come back next week when they restock and get some more suits get some more suits list on ebay yeah i saw on ebay poshmark and mercari my ebay store is linked in my bio if you want to check it out if you're not following hit that follow button top left hand corner i do these lives every single week i go to this thrift store fill up my cart full show you guys everything i'm picking up so make sure you hit that follow button i also have tons of content here on tiktok i have content on youtube facebook instagram make sure you follow me on all those platforms here's a peter millar but they want 15 for it that's too much That'll be half off next week, and that's when I'll probably scoop that Peter Millar. Appreciate all those follows coming in. After this, we'll go to the women's cardigan section. And then you ladies in chat, I need you to hang out with me. And I need you to let me know what I'm supposed to be picking up and passing on. Because your boy is not a... Your boy doesn't wear many ladies' uh, garments. Actually, fun fact, I don't wear any. So, I'm going to need your help. You ever go to the bins? I don't go to the bins. My sister does. Um, I let her have the bins in our area. I go to the thrifts. Not many usually, yeah. Not many usually. I'm glad you caught that. Sometimes, you know, on occasion, but not usually. Where is this? A store called Red, White, and Blue. Um, I'm going to pick this up. This is Summer Comfort, and it has this little crest on the front. Um, this won't really hurt the value too much, so we'll pick that up. It's another Peter Millar, but they want 15 bucks for that one. That will be half off next week. Lots of Peter Millars here, but they want a little too much of them. That's fine. They'll be half off, and we'll scoop them up half off. Iron Eagle. It's so organized it is. It's really nice. The store is super, super nice. Everything on the racks is normally in really good condition. You don't have to worry about stains usually. Um, they go through their stuff and they put up really good stuff. So I like this store a lot. They even have shoes. Like, look at that. Look at all those shoes over there. I don't even touch the shoes here. 
I'm not really much of a shoe reseller, so. Let's see what we got here. Calvin Klein. Damn you, Calvin. Yes, shoes. Um, well, what I do is I leave them because my buddy Ethan comes here and he's strictly a shoe reseller. So I like to leave them for him. Um, Ethan's my dog. So I like to leave I like to leave some stuff for my dog. I'm going to leave. Uh, I'm going to pick this up. Southern Tide. It's only three bucks. I normally would leave the Southern Tide, but three bucks I can't pass. Even if I sell that quick for like even surf sub method on that $14.99 plus ship, um, it'll sell super fast. So it's a decent size. Look at those Air Force Ones. Holy cow. What, 50 bucks or 45 bucks for them but they're pretty crazy air force one says t says mr on the side what brand are you looking for i'm looking for brands with good resale value there's tons of them i'm looking for if you want to know the brands i sell consistently my ebay store is linked in my bio go to my ebay store store look at what i have listed and you can also filter for sold and you can see what i've sold for the last 90 days that's nice of you, yeah. I don't I don't really list shoes too often too. I, I buy them, but I don't list them. They like sit forever. So I'd rather let somebody that's actually going to list them and make some money on them. I'll let him, I'll let him have them, so. Do you go to flea market? I don't go to flea market, no. We have a flea market near us, but I've been there a couple times and it hasn't been the greatest. So I, uh, I don't go to the flea market. I'd rather come here and like, look, I can get everything I need to list in one week and one day, so. I'd rather just come to the store. All right, women's cardigans are next. I've already been through all of these sections. By the way, shout out to everybody that says I steal so much and I don't leave anything behind. I've already went through all of these. I've went through all of this. I've went through all of that. There's plenty for everybody. What did they say on the side? What do you mean? Uh, I gotta find an aisle that I can scoot down real quick. The shoes, oh, they said MR. It said Mr. MR. I don't know what that stands for. Um, they're Air Force Ones. They look to be an older style, too. Do you always add shipping? No, I don't. Most of my items are free shipping, but the uh, the cheaper items, the lower priced items, I use the surf sub method. So that's you price it low plus shipping, and it like makes the buyer think they're getting a better deal when actually they're just paying the same price as I would with Sipor free shipping. So just $22 looks a lot worse than $15 plus $6 shipping or $7 shipping. Eileen Fisher for 10 bucks. That's too much for an Eileen Fisher. We've been selling a ton of Eileen though lately. A ton of Eileen. All right, ladies, ladies in the chat. I need you. I need you. Need to get all of this stoof. Hopefully I find some more barefoot dreams. Last week we found five barefoot dreams in this section. Five. Pretty crazy. Was that We the Free? No, there wasn't any We, we the Free. I would have I stopped on We the Free. North, I look at that. I was trying to be like North Face. So, are two hundred on eBay? But what are they selling for? I don't care about what they're listed for. You gotta, you gotta see what they're actually selling for. And again, I might just leave those for Ethan because if I buy those, to be honest, they're just gonna sit around. They'll never get listed. Ethan will find those. Every. What's up, flipping nurse? Flipping nurse in the house. How are you on this fine morning? Women's clothes are too volatile. Uh, yeah, no. Uh, we've been selling a ton of women's lately. Cause shout out Kayla. She's been she's been destroying it in the women's section. Hold on, chat. Banana Republic. What a waste of my life trying to look for that tag. Um, but Kayla's been destroying it in the women's section. She's been doing really, really good. Like today, there's an Athleta. Look at that. See, Athleta size small for five bucks. It's gonna be half off that price. J Jill. I don't pick up J Jill. Uh, I've been told not to pick up J. Jill in most cases. There are some 
slight variances to that, but I don't pick up J. Jill. Uh, you never get that second back. Thank you for all your advice. Appreciate you stopping in. Thank you for uh, always hanging out. I appreciate you. I appreciate everybody that hangs out in, uh, in chat. And make sure you come to our live tonight at uh, at eight thirty Eastern Standard Time PM. We're gonna be doing uh, we're gonna be going over the hall, me and Kayla. So you're gonna see the men's and the women's. If you if you ladies in the chat want to watch uh, somebody thrift the women's, obviously we just got here, but my wife uh, she comes with us or with me and she does the women's section. So um, she's over there right now thrifting live. Also over at K the Book Nerd. K the Book nerd J. Jill has great clothes they do but I have the, the resale value just isn't there and that's what I'm here for I'm here to find stuff to uh, to resell so J. Jill just doesn't doesn't like resell very well in most cases unless you're getting like super cheap at the bins or something like that um, but I'm paying I'm paying up for it here it's a nice J. Crew look at that J. Crew like a little button Yep, there she is, Kay the Book Nerd, if you want to go watch her thrift right now as well. Or just want to hop over there and give her a follow. Water Creek. Come on, where are the barefoot dreams? Ooh, there we go. Got a North Face, size small, for five bucks. Just like a little plain North Face, size small. Can't pass on that North Face. Here's a spider. I don't pick up spider anymore. Spiders sold at Costco now. It's kind of fell off a little bit. J. Crew loser for resale. Yeah, there's certain pieces that are okay to pick up, but that piece is a. Uh, I'll, I'll pass on it. What is this store called? It's called Red, White, and Blue. I come here every week, so if you're not following, follow. And watch me thrift every week. There's a Mave, but they want 24, even half off. It's too much. Too much for the Mave. <laughs> where are the barefoot dreams where are the barefoot dreams princess polly princess polly remember that from last week so many cute knits yeah there's so, so many uh, nice items in the store you could easily come here and buy yourself a whole new wardrobe within like probably like 10 minutes of being in the store to be honest don't buy new just go to uh go to the thrift store and buy used the store is this is called red white and blue red white and blue thrift all the ladies in the chat are looking at all these sweaters they're like oh my god what store is this oh my god girl you gotta go to that store did you see that k-way guy he found like so many cute tops I need to go to that store. Girl, call your friend right now. Girl, watch this guy right now. He is killing it at the thrift. Uh, what do you think? Um, black and white? I have no clue. If it's a women's brand, your, your boy has no clue about that brand. <laughs> I am learning the women's section so, uh, slowly but surely. You guys like that? I got a good... Uh, I, got a, I can't say the word, but you know what I'm saying. I got a good voice for that. I don't want to say the word that goes with it because some people might get offended, but, you know. Girl, he is killing it. Is that good? Guinevere? Guinevere? I passed on that. I don't know if that's good. Let me know. Is Guinevere good? Pass on Princeton's probably not. Vineyard Vines, yeah. I see you see like a very, very expensive brand. Yeah, Barefoot Jeans is good. We actually sell it on Whatnot. Um, everybody loves Barefoot Dreams, so we just move them really quick on Whatnot. We sell them for less than we uh, can get for them, obviously, but they're just quick sales and everybody loves them. Is that Goodwill? Yeah, no. If it was Goodwill, everything would be priced at $8 or more. And there was no half off. No such thing as half off in Goodwill. You'll probably think, um, I get child support check. But no, I thrift, exactly. I thrift. Beachy. Beachy. Passed on boss? I probably did. Should I be going back? If you guys are telling me brands that I should I should be picking up, 
you gotta tell me two things, okay? You gotta say, go back and get that blank because it resells on eBay for blank. I need to know what the resell value is because I know a lot of people say like, Madewell, you skipped on Madewell, but this Madewell will probably only go for like 15 bucks. So, be like, hey, k wait, go back and grab that Madewell top because it resells on eBay for blank. And then I'll go back and grab it. And I apologize, I believe I didn't see the item. I'll go back and look for it. I know where it is. Let me get through the rest of this rack and we'll go back. <clears throat> J. Crew. Oh my gosh, the sweater section is packed because we're in Florida and nobody's buying sweaters right now. So this is the best time of year to hit this section because you're going to find some gems just chilling in here. Calvin Klein sells good suit jackets, um, but they 45 or more on Posh. Okay, Calvin Klein suit jackets. Women's suit jackets, I assume. The men's, I don't think, sell very well. I thought homie was whistling at me. I thought he was whistling at me. Let's see what we got. LL Beans. I'm pretty happy we didn't go through suits today. I would have I would have hated to grab like another 20 suits today. So I would have never got them listed. Can you tell wool and cashmere by touch? Yeah, you, you can. Generally you can. There's another J. Jill, Calvin Klein. This section is kind of dry today. Soft surroundings. Like this feels nice. I'm trying to show you guys the labels, but it is just so freaking packed here. All the sweaters are from the smart people up north who moved to Florida. No, so actually these are coming from up north. Like literally they're just shipping them down for up north. So the this store gets their stuff from Virginia, I believe. Um, they have like a location in Virginia where they send all the stuff down here. So all year round, this sweater section will be packed, but it's just because they're getting it from up north. And then all year round, we'll be going through this sweater section and you guys will see like this stuff will be, you know, packed in here, but then we'll find stuff like this in XL Women's North Face for literally five bucks. Perfect condition, really nice. So this is the perfect time of year to pick this stuff up. Um, I might put it away that i might put it away and then list it um later on this year but you might as well pick them up like, I mean, you can't just you can't pass up a women's 2xl north face for five bucks it's just that's easy money all right chat need your help again lululemon size 8 for 34.99 this is what it looks like it's got a little little neck on it what do y'all think? $17.50 is what I'm gonna pay for this. What will it sell for? What will this sell for on the Ebays? Looks to be in good condition. I don't see any spots on it. Too high, yes, yes, size. It's a size eight. It's a size eight. 35, 40, too high. Yeah, if it's only gonna go for 35 to 40, it's too high for me. So we're gonna pass on that. See, that's why I always ask. People say yes, and then I tell them to resell, and they're like 35 to 40. So after fees, shipping, cost of goods on that, if I sell it for 35, I'm only gonna make maybe 12. Not worth my time. It's an awesome item, but it's just too much. <gasps> Beard, oh, I thought that was women within. That's a great brand. It is, Blue is an awesome brand but not for that price. That price is what makes it not so awesome. Turns a good item to a bad item, but that's okay. That'll sit here for weeks and they'll finally mark it down and then that's when I'll pick it up. Here's another North Face. It's a fluffy North Face. I'm probably gonna scoop this as long as it's a decent size. If it's a size small, I'll probably leave it. The size medium, it's a $13 North Face, but it's this nice fluffy North Face. And these normally sell really fast for 35, so I'll pick that one up. See, that is like a $15 profit after the shipping cost of goods, and it'll sell super fast. That's worth my time. And that might be a whatnot item too. I might just throw that up on whatnot. Sell it super fast. You like the music? Yeah, too bad it'll get me demonetized on Facebook. 
you won't hear anything or not facebook but youtube you you won't hear anything on um youtube this this part like they'll see my hand waving and they'll think like what is he saying but i have to mute this part because <laughs> they can be like that is a copyrighted music in the background of your your video um thumbnail 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 there you go thumbnail i'm going shopping let's go Got a whole rack of jackets here. Whole rack of jackets there, women's jackets. Um, they do it on TikToks to meeting videos. Yeah, it's okay. You guys get the idea. The good thing about this is you don't need to hear my voice to be able to see what I'm doing. Anime, anime shirt. I don't know what this is though. What is this? What is this? Maybe somebody knows in the chat. Sometimes these anime pieces can be worth money. But I have no clue. How many items do you normally get in one stop? Um, last few weeks we've gotten like over 100 items in the store every time we stop, so. No on the anime piece, okay. I'd normally pick this up as a men's 2XL, but it's got this stupid logo on it, so. I don't know that brand either. Eddie Bauer any good? No, I normally pass on Eddie Bauer. I know Escada can be good, right? Escada can be good. It is 25 bucks though. And it is a wool, I believe. Yeah, it's a 100% wool Escada piece. What do you all think? It's 25 though. What will, what will this sell for? Look at this pattern on it. It's like a nice, nice pattern. Get the Escada. Should I get it? What, what will it sell for though? Somebody saying no. Pass on a Scotta for that price? Yeah. I think I'm gonna pass on it too for that price. Skip, okay, cool. Thank you, ladies. It's a perfect song for this section of the thrift store. All right, got another North Face, but they want too much for it. Another one that they want too much for it. Another one they want too much for it. It's 14 bucks. We'll save it for uh, next week. Pass through filling, yeah. I'll scoop those next week. Moth. Isn't Moth a good brand? Isn't this a good brand, ladies? Moth. You want 20 bucks for it, though. Ouch. But it has this cool little design on the bottom. Moth is anthro. That's what I figured. Kind of looks like an anthro piece. Viscose, nylon, cotton. Moth for that price? Okay. At least I know now it's an anthro brand. I learned something new today. Not worth it, okay. Appreciate ya. Appreciate ya, ladies. All right, let's see. We gotta get in here. It's another North Face, but it's got a logo on the front, so we'll pass. Oh my God, it's my favorite show. I used to watch every episode. Um, if it's a good label and a decent price, do you still buy it even if it's ugly? Yeah, I look up resale value. So if people are buying it, I'll buy it. That's the key. People have to be buying it for me to buy it. 
what's anthropology it's like a isn't it like a store it's like a store that has a bunch of uh brands underneath it Eddie Bauer. Uh, friends are still hot, but it'd be original, yeah. Yeah, I'm not picking that up either way. American Eagle Outfitters Gold Label. Hot Topic, Duluth. No barefoot dreams today. Man, that sucks. I want to find some barefoots in here. 9k moss is listed 800 sold around 20. okay yeah we'll pass on that one then at least we know from now on it's a it's a uh, anthro brand vince cashmere i think it's cashmere this feels like cash yeah it's wool cashmere wool and cashmere but they want 15 for it. Do I grab it for 15? What is this gonna sell for? It's a wool cashmere. What, what, what do you think this will go for? Wool cashmere blend, Vince, like, what is that, like a mock neck? Vince is expensive, I know it's, trust me, I know Vince is expensive, but what will it resell for? Because I normally pass on Vince just because resell value isn't there. 20 bucks, yeah, see, 20 bucks is not gonna work. Eighty bucks, ninety bucks. Okay, that's more my style. Eighty bucks, ninety bucks. I'll definitely grab it for that. For yourself, forty, forty-five, or forty-four to fit. That's very specific. Forty-four to fit. Oh, okay. Here we go. This is more my style. I know this is like some of you guys would be like Brooks Brothers, but this is a silk cashmere Brooks Brothers for six dollars and fifty cents. And then look at that pattern. Resell is thirty to forty. Yeah. Freaking mortar 40, okay. That is a pickup for 650. It's cashmere and silk. Brooks Brothers for sure. Okay. Yes, for sure, Vince. Okay. So Vince. Vince, I'll, I'll look up comps afterwards. If you don't see it tonight on my live, you know what happened to it. It got left because the comps were not there. But I'm gonna trust you, you all in the chat. You guys know better than me. Like I said, I don't wear women's clothes too often. Just kidding, I don't wear it at all. Theory, theory, theory sweater for eight bucks. And this is, this is probably a pickup too. It's a hundred percent cashmere theory for eight bucks. That is a pickup. I don't have to ask chat. I don't have to ask you guys and gals. No animal print, they're cute. What? Nothing there was animal print. Intermix. Yes, and it's cute. Okay. You all got to tell me what cute tops are because I'm a dude and I don't wear cute stuff. <laughs> Pick up Zara. Um, sh should I be picking up Zara? That's the question. Um, you should be telling me because I don't know women's clothing very well. I'm just here winging it right now. This is me winging it. H&M Disney, ooh, H&M Disney collab. This is a J. Crew, and this feels like, whoops, that, that thing just fell. Uh, white, white's not half, yeah, white's not half off. It's acrylic, wool, yeah, that's probably a pass. Acrylic and wool is a pass. Is ours oversaturated? Yeah. Back to the chat. Ralph Lauren. Cracker Barrel. I love that place. I love getting me a Cracker Barrel. Get me some flapjacks. Boy, I love me some flapjacks. A little flapjacks and a little coffee. I'm more of a bacon kind of gal. I don't really like that. Uh, I don't really like sausages in the morning. North Face, 750. Just a plain North Face. I'm gonna leave that one behind. Somebody else can have that. 
320 list is 89 sold theory all over the place some high okay 100 cashmere though you gotta look that's the key for that for that look up is you gotta look up 100 cashmere with your your search the cash is what's gonna sell that bad boy 399 Wayne sounds like he's losing it. No, I'm just being myself. I am never losing it. Ooh, free fly. How much they want for it? 250 for free fly. Yes, please. Good brand to be on the lookout for. Let me show you the tag really quick. This is a, I believe this is a women's free fly. This might actually be a men's too. I got to look up, but that is a, that's the brand free fly. Good brand to be on the lookout for. For 250. 250. Made well. There's tons of made well here. No to women's Ralph Lauren. Um, I don't know. Should I be picking it up? Love and Joy. Love and Joy 2X. Kind of reminds me of a Barefoot Dreams. All right, here we go. This is a youth, though. Ah, this is youth, and it's got a stain on it. Make sure you always check the sizes to youth. Should be over in the kids section. Uh, Maxwell is good. Free fly size. Size on the free fly is a size XL. Size XL. By the way, if you guys see anything you're interested in, hit me up on IG and I will give you a great deal on the stuff. Because with IG, if you and you have to send money through PayPal or Venmo. Um, and I can uh, give you a good deal because we skip out on those eBay fees. So I've just passed that savings on to you all. And that way I don't have to list any of this stuff too. So if you see anything you like, just hit me up on. Um, if women you want, okay, hit me up. I don't know if this is, a, it looks like a women's to me. Whoops. It doesn't say women's on the tag. And I don't really know how to look these up to tell if they're women's. But it's an XL. This might actually be a men's to be honest. I don't know. that Those shoulders look like, they look like a... Uh, kind of looks like a women's piece so and with free fly i don't really know how to tell if it's a women's or a men's i guess i just have to look up the style number if they even have one men to me yeah it kind of looked like a men's to me too yeah now that i'm thinking about it, it probably is a men's i mean on me yeah it's probably a men's it would fit me so that's a men's that's a men's I'll go with men's. Look at that. And you're buying for Target. I love Target. My husband wants to let me go there because I get lost every time I go. Anthropology. 15 bucks though. Brooks Brothers. This feels like it's like a wool. It looks taken at the waist. Yeah, it's still definitely a buy. Yes, I'm going to buy it either way. 100% wool. Brooks Brothers. $2.50. What do you ladies think? Do Brooks Brothers women's items sell well? This is 100% wool. It's 250. It's a nice pink too. I'd like to buy the free fly today. Okay, somebody already is buying the free fly. Um, the free fly will be 20, 25 shipped if that works for you. What do you think? No? Ah, uh, I say no. Okay, we'll leave it. Yeah, somebody just hit me up about the free fly. I'll, uh, I'll give it to you 25 shipped. 25 shipped. Let me know if that works. No shipping costs for you. Wallace and Barnes. J. Crew. Wallace and Barnes. New with tags. What's the retail price on that? Probably doesn't say it, does it? Nope. Wallace and Barnes. J. Crew. That free fly women's. It's a, I believe it's a men's. I believe it's a men's. I can't really tell. There's... I'd have to look up a style number when I get home, and I don't even see a style number on it, so I'm going to assume it's men's. I'll just look up comps on eBay and see, like, what everybody else has theirs listed for, men's or women's, or I'll just go to the website and look uh, what they have it for. It is women's? Okay. Cool. Okay, now we know. It's women's. Thank you for that. I wish they put, like, a men's and women's on it, so 25 works? Okay. Um, Marlene, 
has it. Marlene has it. It's yours, Marlene. I'll hit you up after the live. Um, my Venmo is Kway Shop. I, uh, uh, PayPal is also Kway Shop. So either way, you just Kway Shop. And if you check it, just make sure you check and make sure that it uh, has my picture in the background. Both of them should have it. Here's a Burberry London. It's just a simple sweater and they want 40 for it. Um, pass on that. It's too much. Ooh, it's a free people. Damn, the tag's ripped off though. Somebody ripped the tag off. And I don't want to stand in line and ask them for the price, but that's a nice free people. Uh, it is Google it? Okay, cool. I'll do it after live. Appreciate you for uh, looking that up. Damn, I wish this... Uh... Yes on the J Crew with J Crew. I don't remember hitting a J Crew. Damn, I wish they had the price on this. I would probably pick this up. Actually, I'm just going to take it. I'm going to ask them at the checkout. If that is, what do you what do you all think? If that's under ten dollars, I'll pick it up. Is that good? Ten dollars for that one. Here's a North Face women's small hoodie, but it's got a stain on the front. J Crew too. Which which J Crew was it though? I don't remember hitting a J Crew. I've hit so many of them. Where's the J Crew that I passed? What color was it? Oh, Wallace and Barnes. Ooh, okay. It was new with tags. I wonder where it was though. It was back here, wasn't it? Oh, there it is. 10 bucks. Okay, that's money. All right, cool. We'll scoop that one up. Thank you. Thank you for looking that one up. What'd you say? 96 listed and 96 sold. So 100% sell through rate on that. That is pretty awesome. And it is brand new. Can't be brand new. All right, that's it. That's all she wrote, people. I'm gonna go check up with Kayla and see what she's doing, how much more she has to go through. And then your boy's probably gonna dip out of here. We gotta go through everything. Thank you, my saver store is actually for profit as well. Let's go. Yeah, this store is for profit as well. This isn't a savers though. All right, let's see where Kayla is. Let's see what she's uh, she's finding. She said she found another fig set today for five bucks. We sold one for 40 within a day of listing. So let's go, let's go. Men's items to look? I've already, I've already went through the men's section, so. Let me see where, see where Kayla is. Where is she? Where is she? There she is. Sneaking up on her. How much more you got? Yeah, I'm done too late. Look up some stuff. Soft look surroundings. Look how pretty it is on the back. Oh my god, it's so pretty. Oh my god. Yeah, I think I'm, I'm good too. I got enough. I got enough. Yeah, because you beat me, so I had to I had to come back and get a W today. Listen, we have quality and quantity. Oh, we well, we have quality and quantity. We have so. quantity. All right, chat, I'm going to go ahead and head off. Make sure you hit the follow button. If you hit the follow button, you'll get a notification. We go live tonight at 8.30. I'm going to go over my finds and her finds tonight on live, 8.30. You can either follow us here or watch it on YouTube or Facebook or wherever you want to watch it. We'll be live everywhere. So appreciate you guys hanging out. Catch you on the next one. Peace.